Communities in western Japan are dealing with scenes just like this one. After a 7.6 magnitude earthquake, at least six people have died with buildings reduced to rubble by the powerful quake and the aftershocks. As Wendy Gillette explains, there are warnings of a possibility of tsunamis in coastal areas. A newsroom in western Japan violently rocked when the earthquake struck just after four Monday afternoon sent items tumbling to the ground at a grocery store and unleashed floods at a train station. Suddenly it get pretty strong earthquake and so everybody was, was panicked that time. The 7.5 magnitude quake left cracks in roads, damaged homes and caused this fire. Japan immediately issued its highest level tsunami alert and residents were told to head to higher ground but that has since been lowered. The last time Japan issued a major tsunami warning was in 2011, when an 8.9 magnitude quake hit the country and brought massive waves, killing thousands and causing a meltdown at the Fukushima nuclear plant. This quake was far less severe, and there have been no reported problems at the country's nuclear facilities. But strong aftershocks are still a possibility. Wendy Gillette, CBS News.